Zyru Website Builder Complete Tutorial for Beginners Step by Step. Hello guys, Celia here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we use Zyru to create our own website. It's pretty easy, just follow these steps I do to not make any mistakes. So here we are on Zyru.com. We can find some information about their products, resources, web templates and pricing of course. In order to get started we need to click on Start for free. We can click here, here, basically all that leads to the same page we'll need to create an account i've already done it so now i'm on my home page here and as you can see we have like websites domain subscription folder also we have opportunity to create new website in the right top corner right up here and we can also like manage our account we can find the account settings security billings payment methods and so on so on the websites folder we can find all of our websites as you can see I have one here so we can edit, we can manage, we can choose a plan or we can preview website, duplicate or rename. Also we have the opportunity to delete so let's click on delete to create one um, from scratch. So let's click on get started and after that we'll come to this page where we can find a lot of uh, different customizable templates we can create so we can simply click on all templates or we can find some of the categories for example e-commerce like technology fashion photography portfolio resume and so on in this case i'm going to use one of e-commerce category let's try to find something which is suitable as for us so let it be for example i think this one is pretty good let's click on preview and as you can see, yeah, it looks pretty good. So let's click on start building and we'll come to our edit page. We need to wait for a little. It depends on their like server's capacity. So here we are on our uh, settings or our editing page. We can find the website like preview here where we can hover on every single element to customize it. Uh, also in the left side there is a menu with different options we can add element here as you can see they provides us the opportunity to add some text button add to back image gallery video map and so on a lot of stuff we can add also we can manage our page and navigation the next folder here about shop blog and contact also there is like sub pages here so we can change for example the order of our pages and so on or we can swipe them here and as you can see in the menu they also change their order so for example if we need to move shop to the last page you can find it right up here so it's pretty cool if we're going to manage our pages and navigation also we can manage them we can just simply click on the settings icon we can make it as a home page we can add some CEO settings, password, rename, duplicate or delete. So let's delete our product area here and yeah, I'm going to delete it. This is a way basically of how can we interact with our pages on the like this area. Also, we have the opportunity to change the website styles. We can change colors, text, buttons and animation. In the colors area, we can change the text we are go color we are going to use. So we can just simply click on select and try to... Uh, change it to the right maybe red color so let it be like accept and as you can see all the colors were changed here we can find the information how many times was it used so 125 times so it's like the main color here let's go uh, to change it back to like basically uh, white as for me it's like better so as you can see sometimes there could be some bugs or something like this so be careful yeah just simply click on accept yeah everything is changed so on this page we can change the colors also we can change the fonts for our text as you can see change the buttons how they will look like so for example like this like this and of course change the animation we can add some fade slide or scale sometimes fade animations are pretty cool so we can try to use them and they also have like a block area where we can manage all of our blog posts here so as you can see if we need to add some post we can just simply click on add a new post in the bottom of the screen and then just create it so let's try to create 
as you can see our like template looks like this so we can customize every single part here and after that just click on post so yeah also we have the option to find the online store area where we can customize our store we can add some products we can manage them we can manage the whole store so basically this is the way of how can we deal with online stores if we are going to create them here so let's go back and we have like analytics area where we can find a lot of information about our viewers like different their location what pages did they visit and so on uh, on the main uh, basically on the main page here where we can edit every single part we can click somewhere and then just we can click on edit add some text how we can for example change the text here let it be like the name of our channel let it be the helper man so it, it it's also like a little bit strange i don't know why but sometimes it could be like bugged or just something like this so as you can see now i i'm not able to write something so let's try to click on add element and add text so let's write it here helper man so change the text also uh, color and we can change the position basically it looks like this as you can see there is like small rectangles here they help us to make the navigation easier uh, in this case we can customize every single part we can move them we can change for example edit button we can change the bottom text let it be like subscribe or something like this so uh, we can change where we will link we can change the address for example we can lead it to our youtube channel and so on so there is like a lot of options here we can find and in this case we can interact with every single part for example we can change the background now it's like image here but we can uh, simply change the other ones for example like this here so it looks pretty cool yeah and now our like website is not about like some supplement now it's about like our personal plant or some somebody here so in this case we can interact with every single part and after that we can just simply click on save and then just click on go live so we can like edit it on the mobile or do some other stuff let's click on uh, like this here go live and as you can see we have like purchase a zero plan to publish your website so we'll have to publish uh, we can click on choose a plan and as you can see there is like uh, some options here we we can find like exclusive deal for 8.9 per month or like two years for 5.9 per month plus one month for free so as you can see there is like a lot of stuff uh, basically they provide us a lot of different sales and so on so here we can find some information we can add some like uh, create an account choose a payment method and so on so basically this is a way of how can we work with Zyro to create our website I hope guys this video helped you out. If it is, please leave a like, comment and subscribe. If you have any questions, you can write them in the comments below. I wish you a very good day. Goodbye.